Congratulations to our final four. Yeah. It's real now. Each of you should be gearing up to be Australia's next top model. <laughs> so girls, making it to the final four is definitely cause for celebration. Don't you think? Yeah. Yes. 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 I'm thinking maybe like pizza, some like gelato. Yeah, but pizza's going to be good. You know, pizza's going to be like the real deal, yeah. I reckon. Yes. yes. I mean, there's like the place oh that's probably God. like the authentic home of pizza and gelato. It's <laughs> Oh, oh my goodness. 
I know that these guys are amazing because they are my color agency. That's definitely somebody that you want to impress. Please welcome Saverio Rottini. is full of cute and amazing girls. Most important thing is to stand out from the crowd. The first impressions are huge. Gaia will be reporting back to us about how you walk, talk and present yourself today. And when you go to castings, it can change everything. I just happened to go along one day to a casting for a TV commercial that was for an Italian client. Ended up getting the job. That one commercial not only led to me having such an amazing career and, and coming and living here. But it's a really important lesson that when you go on a casting, you've got to use those few minutes you can to impress. Yes. So for today's challenge, you'll be split into two teams. Oh. And you'll have to make your own way to the casting. I have no idea how we're going to make our way around a foreign city. So Elena and Daisy, you will be working together.
feel like this. I just think it's so hard to just make eye contact, let alone talk. <laughs> I've been really good with my anxiety for the last couple of weeks. I've been managing it fine, but I wasn't in a good state. And I was like, oh, God, I'm just, like, going to ruin it. I'm going to blow this whole opportunity for myself because of this stupid anxiety. Daisy, she has a sporty body. 
but because she has very strong shoulders, she needs to work a little bit on her posture because when she walked, she was a bit rigid. Grazie mille. <laughs> You're welcome. Thank you very much. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Ta -ta. I just don't want to be sent home because people think that, oh, you can't handle this. So that took a lot of courage. And the, there you go. If you want to ask, like, why do you want to be here? That shows how much I want to be here. <laughs> Getting double time in the photo shoot tomorrow. This photo shoot is the ticket to the and that's something that we're all aiming for. We have double time on the photo shoot tomorrow if we win the challenge, which is amazing. I really want this double time. So, girls, massive day today, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Running around town doing castings. Castings are the soul of this business, girls. You have so little time to make a good impression to the clients. Saverio so and I have received the feedback from Gaia. Ready to hear? <laughs> so I'm going to start with Linnea. Um, so Gaia thought you had an extraordinary face and a really beautiful look. But she could tell there was just a little bit of a, a lack of confidence. That's something you learn with years um, and over time. I thought I walked in pretty confident, but I guess I'm easy to read. I have to work on it. So Gaia thought you were very much a Trisati girl. You could be a Trisati model. She wanted to see that transformation in you to be a bit more fierce and a bit more strong. Yeah. But she thought you were fantastic. <laughs> My feedback was quite good. So I'm happy and quite confident. Daisy. Gaia thought you had a hot bod, <laughs> but she said because you're so tall and because you're so athletic, you need to really be aware of your posture and that you really need to work on your hair. I always tell to my model that if you work good, that would be the thing that will bring you really far. Being like a good worker is like really, really important in this business. Elena. So Gaia Trasadi said that you were pretty neutral when you came in. You didn't give too much away. Some designers, they prefer that. For some designers, they kind of want a little bit more from their girls. But you did comment that you had a great walk. It was solid. You nailed that. So, girls, today wasn't just about giving you that experience of doing castings. There was also a very big prize on the line. Double the time in front of camera at tomorrow's photo shoot. I never won a challenge before. To win in the line would be such a big deal. The winner of today's challenge is... Feel great, but um, 
like hazel trees, and I just gotta do my best in the photo shoot. Next, you'll be wearing some of the most exquisite Italian designer clothes. Feel the pressure of a high fashion shoot. I never thought I'd be wearing Valentino boots. I'm just in head to toe Dolce and Gabbana. Put the girls off their game. Not so posy. I'm honestly just waiting for that. I just didn't want to hear it, but it matters most. Everything comes down to this photo. The winner of Australia's Next Top Model will receive a 12-month modelling contract with Priscilla's Model Management and will feature in an eight-page editorial spread for Elle Australia. They will also get a $20,000 trip to New York during Fashion Week thanks to Colgate Optic White. And drive away in a stylish Mazda 2 hat. This is the last photo shoot for the Gnarly, which is like the end goal. It is scary going up against Sabina, Lena and Daisy. They're like really strikingly beautiful girls. I don't have any excuse to not produce an amazing photo. I didn't get a great challenge score, but having made it this far, I only want to make it further. Getting the lowest score sucks, but I've had it before and I've turned it around. Who's to say I can't do it this week? Oh, sweet. Buongiorno ragazze. Buongiorno. <laughs> Here we are at a very different part of Milan, La Villa Grande. Beautiful canals. And this will be the location of your most amazing photo shoot today. You'll be wearing some of the most exquisite Italian designer clothes. Valentino, Dolce Gabbana, Fendi, Gucci. Today's shoot is all about being a strong, spirited and stylish Italian woman. Yay! This brief is also the perfect description of your photographer today. <laughs> she has over 20 years experience capturing the most stylish and beautiful fashion photography in the world. She shot from magazines including El Italia, Yes, I 
just going to have lots of fun and try and get an amazing shot. Yeah, we've got the half hour, so yeah, make the most of it. Yes, yeah, exactly. You know. Lucky one. Yeah. I've always wanted to be an international model. This is my shot, and I just want to give it everything I've got. Should we do like a, a quick walk? A quick walk? Yeah, ready to go. Walk and look at me. Not too posy. When you walk, you, you did this. Yeah. So you relax. Just like, even if you go like that. Okay. Ready to go? I wanted to impress, but I was freaking out. I was just so overwhelmed with everyone and everything that was going on, and I honestly just blanked. I was just like, oh my goodness, what do I do? Go. Stop. Now relax, everybody. Not too posy. Elena might have been overmodeling in the face a little bit, especially when Stefani wanted it all quite relaxed. Okay, I'm going to lay all of those, the images, and then so we can see. The halfway mark, and I'm like, wow, I feel like I haven't had that much time at all. So far, we did a lot of things. Yeah. So, like, you know, I think that you can do better than that. I've got the extra 15 minutes so I can really, I don't know, come out of my shell and just try lots of new things. Your face, your body, the bag, the shoes. I think it's look perfect. Okay. Well, Elaine, I probably could do better. She's still, like, in a bit stiff in the body. Now I want you to give me something, right? Okay. It needs to be you. At least, you know. Opportunity is amazing. That's nice. There we are. Being a working model just shows that this is what the real world's going to be like, and it just makes me realize I want it even more. Wow. Yeah. Yes, bravo. It gave me that sort of drive just to try and do as much as I could. Yeah, well, chin down. Go for it. Ah, well done. That was a good shot. I really, really got to experiment with what I was doing, and I got to move around a lot. Everything is perfect. Don't move a thing. So, like, everything is so good. Really simple. Hey, But happy, happy with how I went. But I definitely think I could go home. I think it's anyone's game. Anyone can pull out tens. It, it, you just don't know. The brief for the photo shoot today is about channeling strong Italian women. I'm dressed in head to toe Dolce & Gabbana. The pressure's on. It really comes down to this photo shoot. Sabine! Ci siamo qua! We're up here. This is your shot. She looks amazing. It looks very Italian. I think people have definitely underestimated me. My mom especially tells me that I'm a bit vague. Wow. Oh, you look amazing. You look amazing. Thank you. Very Italian though. <laughs> so I really want to prove myself in the photo shoot. Yeah, let's do something with that. Yeah. yeah. It's so hectic. Okay, perfect. Let's drive. There's people everywhere. Okay, where to go? They're trying to cross the bridge. Shot. 
possibly that. It's kind of frightening. I know that these girls are going to get good photos today. They could get, you know, three tens, that's very possible, and just the little things that count. I didn't do well in the challenge. I'm second last. How are you feeling? Um, I have to really bring it out. Important moment in this competition so far. Miracle. Yeah. Oh. Bring your balance. If I knew wants me to sit on this tiny little handrail, I was like, all right. <laughs> I'm worried about you up there. It was right on the edge of the canal, so I could have like fallen back and fallen in or something. Are you okay? Yeah. yeah. So I kind of have to hold it on or really just like control my leaning. Relax, relax, relax. Watch your hands, honey. Back and balance and like trying to make my hands look nice. Just hold on, just don't be like this. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, and then you put these hands up a little bit. I was a bit scared, but I mean, I wanted a good photo, so I wasn't getting off <laughs> anytime soon. Exactly, like this, you're more stable. Beautiful. I'm wearing this amazing yellow dress. I felt like an actual, like, international model, but I, I don't know, something wasn't right. Relax everything, relax your shoulder, relax everything. Everything. Sit down, relax. Relax. It looks here like this, but you don't look like this. Go like this. Yeah. Say, beautiful. I didn't realize that she wanted me so slumped over, but in the last seconds, pretty much, of this photo shoot, I think I got that shot. Finito. Yeah. I feel like I was just hitting my teeth then. If I had another 15 minutes, I would have been amazing. Go so fast. I huh? hope it's enough. You did your best. You are gorgeous. Stress kind of got to me a little bit. But regardless of the scores, you just gotta keep trying. You just have to have good energy going into the photo shoot, and that's all there is. Daisy, look at you! Wow. I never in a million years thought I'd be 19 years old wearing Valentino in the streets of Milan, shooting with one of the world's best photographers. Make the most of it, this is it. Finale right. week. Hopefully, I didn't blow it. I'm still super nervous. I do really want this. Wait a second. Relax. Relax your face and relax the mouth. My biggest problem, my problem that they always point out in almost all my photos, the mouth. Relax. Relax your mouth. Look at me, look at me. My mouth. I just didn't want to hear it. Relax the mouth. Here we are. But then, chin down a little. Mouth open. Chin down. Chin down. Open your mouth. The least in mouth. The game. Okay, relax. It's gorgeous now. I fixed it. I swear to God, it worked. That's what it is. Yep, done. Your, your mouth is relaxed. Very sexy. Yeah, right. Yeah, strong. And then Gal took one look and she went, oh my God, Daisy, that's the best you've ever looked. So I'm ready for you. That expression, keep that in your mind. On the last Illumination Week, I've cracked for my mouth. Finale, 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 finale. You're so close. Daisy, man, she stepped it up. That is absolutely beautiful. Gorgeous, Daisy. Oh. I saw in Daisy that she really was like, this is it, this is my last chance. Yeah, yes. As well as a girl, they're like, you know, when you look at the flash, you don't really see the potential until you take a picture of her. Beautiful. And then you understand that she's a lady. Beautiful. She's ready. So proud. So proud of you. Everything I've learned on this is like, all thanks to you and everything. It's just Aww.
I've learned so much, I think, going to Milan. I felt like while I was there, I kind of embodied someone who I never really thought I would be. And I'm so much more mature than I was. That is kind of crazy. I almost feel like a different person. So our little Italian adventure is over. This is what I want to do for a career. I can't believe this even is a career. Like, it just seems way too fun. Bye. I need to do whatever it takes to do this for as long as I can until I'm old and wrinkly. But I guess I'll still be doing denture commercials, like whatever it takes, man. <laughs> um, it's just, you know, when you see yourself somewhere and it's like, I can't see myself doing anything else. This today is a double elimination. Oh, my heart just dropped. Who will make it to tonight? I think this photograph is, is beautiful. It's a whole other level, yeah, from previous shoots. I've waited, like, my whole life for this picture. Yeah. Thanks, Lydia. Well done. Thank 
you to look like that in their clothing and embody what that is with that i just i don't believe that it's not possible me oh, i just can't fault this photo I, I love it it's a 10 for me thank, thank you. you it's the best i've seen you look and it's a 10 thank you so much thank you yes. i can't believe it 10 
Daisy, that's two tens. You just stay safe. And now you need a nine or more from Alex. I agree in the, in the way and the fact of I would have loved to receive. 